Chapter one is the evolution of a gas grill pump. Well, at one time, this was a, a bookstore, and so they kind of went with that theme. You know, there was a little restaurant in the back. It was kind of a bookstore, so they ran with the theme of a bookstore, local place uh, where everybody can come hang out at. That we source everything locally, we put our unique twists on modern and classic foods, drinks, um, and we support the community. Well, the culinary cocktails and it is an extension of the kitchen using fresh, unique ingredients and coming up with cool drinks. Uh, we take whatever we have laying around in the kitchen and infuse it with several other things like tequilas with habaneros and limes, uh, vodkas with a bunch of different berries and maybe throw ginger in. It's an infusion of many different kind of berries um, with vodka, um, seasonal berries, and we sous vide it so it brings in this intense berry flavor into the vodka. Plus it takes half the time, or not even, it takes hours to make it versus letting it sit for 10 days in the vodka, old school way, and uh, coming up with it. And like I said, you know, the flavor is so much more intense with the berries. Well, craft beers from Belgium to Japan, we're constantly trading out the handles. We get small batches of beers so we can constantly introduce people to new and exciting new beers. And we have a hundred different types of bottled beers, like once again from Belgium to Germany, from everywhere. I admire Morimoto because I was watching one show on Iron Chef and it was uh, King Crab and he broke down the King Crab and all the fluids that came out of the King Crab went into a pot that he dried that all out which turned into salt and that's what he used to season all his dishes with. I, I thought for something that we take for granted or forget about that they live in the ocean and then salt that he took something so simple and basic like that and used it for seasoning I thought was just genius. Chef's knife. Because you can do anything with it. You can chop wood with it, you can fillet a fish with it, you can open up a coconut with it, you know, it's, it's multi uses. My biggest guilty pleasure is foie gras, pâtés, kind of the same family, just love that stuff. That they had a great experience, they enjoyed the food, they enjoyed our service, they enjoyed our cocktails that it's a little hidden gem in Santa Ana that they weren't expecting to run into.